Hello, I bet you wonder what I'm doing with my day today. Well, I know I look a little rough, but <laughs> no, I did not work in the yard all day. But uh, I've got my hat on and I've just watered. That's, that's all I've done out here today and check the plants. Kind of make a list of what needs to be done tomorrow because I will be home, of course. So, yeah, I will be doing Nope, that's not the sun, that's the moon. <laughs> Isn't it pretty? Nice and full. Also, if I come around a little bit, you can see the lights. They've already decorated the, um, see the lights? They've already decorated the parking lot across the street from me. <laughs> yeah. So we can put the pear tree. Hill, checking out quiet sweet reed there. Sugar cane up top. Come down, take a look at this little guava tree. <laughs> and it's a little companion plant there. <laughs> the alude. Got lots of extra weeds out today. I've been working, even though I didn't do a lot today. Plants from uh, the quite brought from Fresno. This one isn't from Fresno though. That one's from <laughs> that's a lost and found. Found it on the sidewalk. And these we are the um, oh, color lilies that we dug up the other day. We dug these up Wednesday, and we've had some hot weather, and they do not look happy at all. Yeah. Tomorrow I'll be moving these into the shade, into a shadier area. Right, we see the um, persimmon tree, the guava, still have some fruit on there. Can you see? This one right there, coming around, I know there's another one, you can see it there, can you see it? Is that two or one? Coming on around. And here we are. <laughs> That's my pumpkin. I'm saving it for Christmas. There we go. Here's the uh, little Swiss chard. See, it's taking its time, but that's okay. If I can just keep whatever it is from doing the eating, maybe that's not eating, but that looks more like eating right there, doesn't it? The little collard greens. on around. This is the little sugar cane. It's grown quite a bit. <laughs> yeah, you can see the sky. It's kind of dark, huh? It's late. Can you see that across there? They have already uh, decorated the um, parking lot across the street with Christmas lights. I don't know if you'll be able to tell that there's uh, red lights on that. <laughs> Isn't that cute? To the collard greens, flowers, going to seed. Some of these pods look a little small. Yeah, these are kind of small. I don't know if Quiet will want to save any of those. I guess the ones that are earlier in the year are probably better. At least they look better to me, they look bigger. More collard greens and something eating the little tree. 
little plum tree. I say plum tree, but when you look down at the bottom, there's lots of little things down there. We will need to dig that up one of these days and figure out if we're going to keep one of them. Cutting back of the flowers will have to happen tomorrow. Look at cute little bowl. <laughs> yeah, we're still trying, even though it's late in the season. Still giving it the a good try. Color greens are looking good there. This is a spot where we got rid of the um, those calla lilies. They came from this spot right here. Well, let's. I think White's probably going to tell me that these can go because this is all dry now. All dry. The main thing is that the seeds are dry too. Here's the radishes. You can tell here that I watered. I don't know if you can tell anywhere else that I watered, but here you can tell. Radishes. You know what, I should have something getting ready soon. I mean, they've been out here probably just about long enough to have something. Let's stick champs. Nope, not yet. Look at that, not yet. The greens will be good. I'm gonna take those. A little bit of onion. Oh, it's gonna mess with my pointing now because I've got radishes in my hand. I'll put those right there. I'll come back for them. <laughs> you see where I put them? <laughs> I'm kind of doubting whether it was a good idea now to put to leave this corn here. Between the corn and the sweet reed, some of my little peas have decided not to be so happy. And I hate to say it, but <laughs> I put this little spinner out here to encourage the grasshoppers to stay away from my Swiss chard there. <laughs> I might get a couple more. Oh, I didn't show you the little lettuce that was here. It's tucked in right by the uh, uh, radishes, so you may not even notice, but uh, that's lettuce. There's another little one there too. Those are from last year. More peas. More peas. Like I said, I don't know if this is a good idea. I might have to get rid of the corn to even have the peas because they are just not as happy as I thought they were going to be. Just a quick glance at the melons. Yes, yes. We are still doing good. <laughs> Beets. Some of us aren't so happy here. Not so happy. But look at this. Look at the comparison in the size. Not so happy. Another happy one. A couple of happy ones. Yeah. I don't know what the difference is. Why some are happy and some are not. some of our smaller melons. I didn't realize there was four melons here. So maybe Wednesday we will do another count. Seems like every time I turn around I see a melon that I didn't really realize was here. When we counted I didn't see four here. Did not see four. I didn't see that little one over there I don't think. Yeah. Well that's all for now. Well, it's getting late, so it's time for me to go in. So <laughs> I'm going to say goodbye for now. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.